world and in the hereafter. The Qur'an is the primary source of Islam for all Muslims. The book is and always has been written in the Arabic language. The Qur'an is so unique in context and style that it cannot be translated. Therefore, any translation is to be taken only as an interpretation of the meaning of the Qur'an. Distinctions must be drawn between the Qur'an and its translations. Any translation of the Qur'an is not the Qur'an in its true and pure form. It is simply a translation and or an explanation of the original masterwork. A translation of the Qur'an is not the word of God, as only the original Qur'an contains the exact Arabic words spoken by God, as revealed to Prophet Muhammad by the angel Gabriel. Different translations of the Qur'an are intended to help non-Arabic speaking audiences comprehend its meaning. Still in all, there is only one Qur'an. Since each translation of the Qur'an is not the original work and is only man-made in context, it is an imperfect translation bound to contain errors. Granted, some translations may be superior in their linguistic style or their interpretations of the Qur'an, yet there remains only one true version of this timeless book. If a Muslim in Asia reads a verse of the Qur'an, one can be sure that another Muslim is reciting the exact same words in faraway Africa. No differences will exist between the two recitations. God has promised always to preserve the Qur'an, protecting the book from anyone attempting to modify or change its text or message. God has promised in the Holy Qur'an to guard his book against any man-made modification, distortions, additions, subtractions, or tampering in any form. The word Qur'an linguistically translates to mean recitation, referring to the recitation of the words of God via the angel Gabriel to Prophet Muhammad. Then the Prophet recited these same exact words to the people. The Qur'an was first revealed in the holy month of Ramadan, which is the ninth month of the Islamic lunar calendar. The remainder of its message was revealed bit by bit for the next 23 years. Each passage was revealed in the wake of a certain major event in the life of Prophet Muhammad. Finally, the book was assembled as a whole in his lifetime. The Qur'an was conveyed to a Prophet that was unlettered, that did not read, write, or calculate, and that had no education. These characteristics serving as a sufficient proof that the holy text was not authored by him. The Holy Qur'an is a widely known and memorized document. In fact, the Qur'an is the only book that is memorized by millions of people of all ages around the world, of all languages or backgrounds, from one end to the other. The Qur'an deals with all Our Prophet narrated, whoever guides another to a good deed will get a reward similar to the one who performs it. So please like, subscribe, and share this video. Assalamu alaikum.